Welcome to American Times instructions on replacing a mechanical movement with the AllSync Plus kit. The replacement kit comes with the parts shown here. The tools you'll need for this installation are listed below. In our example, the old dust cover and movement have already been removed. Start with your simplex clock face up on a soft surface like a pillow or a cushion. Select one of three included bushings to use by center hole diameter and backplate thickness. Choose a rubber washer. The thicker the washer, the further the hands will be from the protective crystal. Place the rubber washer on the all sink movement and insert it through the center hole from the back of the clock. Next, thread on the center mounting nut. Use a half inch nut driver to tighten the nut down. Don't over tighten or you could damage the movement. Flip the clock over and check to see if the orientation of the movement is straight, with the buttons at the 12 o'clock position. Next, apply the hands, placing the hour hand on first. In the all sync kit, the hands are all press-on hands. Push down on the hour hand using a quarter-inch nut driver. Repeat the same steps with the remaining two hands. Align the hand to 12 o'clock as best you can. Check to make sure the hands are evenly spaced and not touching each other. If they aren't, slightly bend the hands, but you shouldn't need much adjustment. You can look down the edge of the clock to check. Each of the three hands should point toward 12 o'clock. Lay the protective crystal down over the face of the clock and secure it by pressing down the crystal retention ring. Turn the clock over, face down to install the dust cover assembly. Select the male end of the Molex plug and insert it into the base of the dust cover. The all sync movement arrives with the standard 120 volt power or run and 120 volt core or correction. Here you'll see the default pin placement for run and correction. The jumpers can be repositioned for 120 volt run and 24 volt correction. Like this. Or they can be repositioned for 24 volt run and 24 volt correction. If needed, adjust the run and correction. Now take the dust cover with the circuit board in it. Place the ground wire inside the dust cover and use one of the screws provided in the all sync kit to attach it. Thread a star washer and nut onto the screw and tighten it down. Next, connect the ground wire to the mounting point. Remove the gear locking pin from the movement. Take the multicolored cable and plug it into the movement. The green and yellow wires should be up. Plug the multicolored cable into the circuit board. Place the dust cover onto the back plate and tuck under any wires. Align the three screw holes and tighten them down using the original screws. You've now assembled a simplex clock with an AllSync Plus Zero 2 conversion kit.
For more do-it-yourself videos, visit American-Time.com.